You might think you're only gonna have to see my face for 45 seconds or less, but that's no fun, at least not for me. However, it is true that Alexa Guard is so easy to set up that we're gonna show you how to do it in just over 30 seconds. But before we get started, make sure to pop in your headphones or turn off Alexa's ears because I am gonna be saying that trigger word a few times. So just a little warning there. The next thing I'd like you to do before we set the timer is please just take a second and subscribe to and like our channel. And that way you're not gonna miss out on any of the insider safety tips and safety news that we post here at least twice every single week. Plus, if you're the kind of person that likes things to last a little longer than 45 seconds, please read our complete guide to Amazon Alexa and everything you can do with her on safewise.com. And to make it super easy, we have linked it in the description box below. But wait, there's more. You can also watch our video that answers the question, what the heck is Alexa Guard? To prove that we're not pulling your leg about how fast and easy it is to get Alexa Guard on the job in your home, we're gonna take you straight through the setup without any interruptions. Then, after you're all impressed with my speed and my technical savvy, I'm gonna share my answers to the most frequently asked questions to make your Alexa Guard set up and use the best that it can be in your home. All right, let's get this baby set up. Set your timers. Step one, open the Amazon Alexa app. Step two, go to settings. Step three, scroll down and select guard. Step four, select setup guard at the bottom of the screen. Step five, use the guided navigation to select the smart alerts you want. You can choose from smoke and carbon monoxide alarm sounds, glass breaking sounds, and away lighting. Step six, add your zip code if you want to activate away lighting alerts. Step seven, confirm your selections. And that's it, you're done. And if my timer's accurate, that took about 41-ish seconds. Not too shabby. But just because you can do something in 45 seconds or less doesn't mean you have to. It was easier for me to fly through the setup because I'm really familiar with Alexa Guard. But for those who aren't, here are some things that you might have missed during that whirlwind setup. What am I actually doing when I activate Alexa Guard? So Guard uses the same smart listening that Alexa uses to hear you when you ask about the weather or hit her up for a joke. The difference is that when you set Alexa Guard to away mode, its ears are on full alert without needing to hear the wake word, which is usually Alexa. So what does Alexa Guard listen for? Alexa Guard listens for smoke and carbon monoxide alarms and glass breaking sounds, but that doesn't mean it won't pick up other stuff. Users have reported getting alerts for things like a loudly ticking clock that's near their Echo device. But even so, false alarms with Guard are pretty rare. One reviewer set his kids loose in the house in an effort to trick the system. And they were only able to trigger alerts when they actually beat a wine bottle to death in a safe, contained manner, of course, that was supervised by said dad reviewer. The other time that it set off an alert is when they actually triggered the smoke alarm. So even though it's going to pick up other sounds, it's pretty specific and sensitive. So is Alexa Guard always recording? Privacy issues, right? This is what we're all worried about. Nope. Your Echo device will only record when it picks up one of the sounds that it's listening for, like glass breaking or the smoke or the CO alarm in your house. So when Alexa picks up those sounds, you'll get a notification with a clip that you can listen to. But you also have the option to drop in and listen live. Or if you have an Echo Show, you can drop in and watch live. See exactly what's happening right then. So what is away lighting and why do I want it? O-M-G, away lighting is super cool. I mean, I'm kind of already obsessed with smart light bulbs and voice control, so it's no surprise that I love, love, love this feature. It brings them both together. Here's the deal. Basically, when you enable away lighting through Alexa Guard, Alexa will activate your smart light bulbs to create the impression that someone's at home. This is only triggered when glass breaking sounds are detected. So the hope is that it will make the would-be intruder think people are hanging out, watching TV, or doing other at-home things, and they might just decide to skip on down the road and leave your house alone. But this setting has even more smarts to offer. 
during setup, it asked you to add your zip code. So the reason you were asked that question is so that Alexa knows when the sun is setting and rising in your neighborhood. And that way, Alexa can adjust the smart away lighting response appropriately. I love it. It's super cool. Well, that's it. Your crash course in how to set up Alexa Guard and put it on the job protecting your home is now complete. To round out your Alexa Guard knowledge though, read our full guide to Alexa Guard on safewise.com. It's linked in the description box below. And if you want more of me in your life, check out our video that answers the confounding question about what the heck is Alexa Guard to begin with. And stay in the know for all things safety when you like and subscribe to this channel. Be informed and safe with new how-to demos, product reviews, and insider tips that are uploaded right here two times every single week. See you next time.